Ah, oh, hello there. Ah, Sean the extra guy here. Yeah, I got this voice again. I don't know why I keep, I keep starting the streams with this voice. And it slowly changes into something I don't even recognise. I don't even know what accent this is supposed to be. But it's somewhere in England, I think. Almost sounds like, you know... Sounds a little bit like Little Britain, Andy. Yeah, I don't like it. Don't, don't like it. <laughs> <coughs> oh, goddammit. Well, anyway. Welcome back to another stream. Uh, another spoopy stream, or at least we hope so. Um, of, uh, the Haunted PS1 Demo Disc 2022. We're not going to play, like, all seven of the ones that are left. <coughs> I'm going to try... Sorry about that. I'm going to try out, um, Benighted again. I don't know if, um... I don't know if it's going to work. Um, but we're going to try Benighted. B Benighted? Benighted. Benighted. What, what is this? That house behind you seems very flammable. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we all know he did it. We all, we all know he did it. He's the one who burnt down the house. We all, we all know he's a pyromaniac. And secretly wants to wear a mask. And carry a flamethrower around. And go, I don't know who I'm doing I don't know who I'm doing I don't know. Okay, that's, that's enough of that. Uh, so, let's uh, pause this music. Uh, let me just put that over to there. And uh, I'm gonna go. Yeah, uh, gotta go find my file again. Fuck. I thought it was in the, I thought it was in quick access, but it wasn't. Uh, okay. Games. Games. Email. Games. Okay. So, uh, where the fuck did I put it again? What the hell? Uh, no, okay, no, I, I remember. Fuck. <laughs> I went, I went to the, um, to my external hard drive, forgetting that I actually installed, um, not installed, forgetting that I moved the files over to, uh, over to a hard drive. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try it, be, be knighted again, see if it was just like, see if it's just, you know, a problem with, um, uh, just needing to restart. Which may very well have been the case. Browse. Okay. Be knighted. Let's try it again. Um. Actually, hang on, hang on, wait. I know what could be an issue. Hang on, uh... I've got an idea. I have got an idea. Run this program as administrator. Actually, yeah. Run this program as administrator. I wonder if that could be the case. So that when it actually does run... The Got It game engine. It's probably just going to hang it. Because apparently some other people were having trouble with this as well, so I'm not the only one. It seems this, uh, this doesn't play well. With some people's systems.
nah, it doesn't work. <laughs> we tried, we tried it again, and I, I'm gonna guess it's not gonna work. Oh well. Unfortunately, I can't try it benighted. B sorry, be knighted. I can't believe I can't. I can't. I can't believe it. All right. We can't go above and beyond. Best experience with a controller. Okay, then. Oh, shit. Wrong, wrong controller. I just... No, we're not going to be playing Xbox One. No, no, no. God damn it. I picked up the wrong controller. i got to turn off my Xbox. <laughs> Give me a second. Fucking hell. Not, we're not secretly playing Xbox today. I mean, maybe, maybe we can play Conan, but I don't know. Anyway, be knighted. If you want to work out how I can play it, that'd be great. But yeah, um, it's just it's broken. At least for my computer, I I don't know why. There's some sort of compatibility issue. Could have something to do with um. Well, anything really, I don't know. Okay, so... Graphisks. Graphisks. Okay. Dither... Fine distortion. Okay. I just wanted to check these. Input mode, vibration, okay. Terminal. Play demo, I guess. This is like F-Zero, I guess. I, I, I'm... Well, not, maybe not F-Zero, but um, definitely Wipeout. Which was a uh, PlayStation uh, property. Until it... Until it... Well, actually, no. There was a N64 um, uh, release. Okay, anyway. Uh... Uh, there's only one I can pick. Oh, hello, V. <laughs> Sorry about that. I was distracted. Is it... Am I doing this right? Cycle through cameras. Um. But yes, hell, happy Friday for Americans. I'm 
I'm trying to, I, I'm trying to think, okay, why is this a horror game? Why is this in the haunted PS1 demo disc? I can think of Colony Wars with the wireframes and spaceships. I think this is supposed to be a, a racing game. I mean, it's a tutorial level at the moment. Wait, what? Simulating damage for training purposes. Oh, I meant to avoid them. Oh, okay. And so far, uh, the, the only thing that's really like that could be horror is like the sound effects or the music or atmosphere sounds but yeah like at the moment I'm not seeing any horror oh by accumulating reference it, it actually wants me to go through this Stop vehicle to exit. Okay. Uh, we're gonna exit. I said stop vehicle to exit. That's what I've done. Future reality. Retire. Terminal. Reality OS. Trans. Uh. Hang on. We. We uh, uh, pingus help. <laughs> Change directly to path. Run exit. For, what? I don't know. We're playing a DOS game. What the fuck is this? Reboot. Oh, eboot. Okay. Again. One argument requires one argument. Well, I, you know, I, I sometimes I have arguments, but this is in this case, I don't think that's what it needs. I don't know what the hell this is for. Uh, Uh, I can't get out of it now. I can't get out of it. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Uh, uh, 
CD. Help. Write arguments to stand out. Clear. Uh, run. Play. OGG audio from path. Print the cool S. Thank you for the hydrate. Well, that's what printing the cool S did. Okay. Uh... Truck unlocked. X Viscera. Barracuda. Shell unlocked. Okay, I'll we'll try out this one then. It's definitely like some F-Zero, um, Wipeout vibes. Like, definitely, um, that. It's, it seems like there could be something there. Give me a second. Shit. This is what happens when I... Okay, I got really confused. God damn it. Shit. How the hell am I supposed to talk and do like this? Apparently I'm coming six. It's got that classical, uh, explosion sound from anime. Radiation bleed. I'm still struggling to find, like, where this is horror. Alright. I, I can definitely see some horror themes, but it's like... Yeah, I don't know. Blue killed Sean, replaced him, in, replaced him with Duke. I always get replaced with Duke. Yeah. Okay, it, it's a 
that's a okay kind of game. I don't know what, I, I, I don't know what the horror aspect is. Like, it says body horror, blood and gore, but I don't know what the body horror is talking about. Shit, I didn't, God damn, I didn't want to do that again. Sorry we're open, no returns. Strobing, gore, language, violence, adult themes. Yeah, my kind of game. Strobing. As a new manager of your local supermarket branch, you'll be expected to manage your employees, tackle both the day and night shifts, and make the hard decisions to keep the store running each, each hour of the day. Remember, your store's reputation and your employees' livelihoods are, your, are in your hands. Cool. Their livelihoods are in my hands. It... Really, you're gonna start in a window like this? Can I, uh, no I can't, apparently. F4. Photosensitivity, photosensitivity warning. This game contains flashing, strobing lights and effects. You may toggle the filter accordingly. Filter can be changed during gameplay. Change filter. Filter off. Start. We lost our E rating. Sorry we're open is about making the most of your impending doom. You will not always be equipped for the encounters ahead. An escape may be the only vi viable option. You and your employees will die and your progress and actions are permanent. The following gameplay assets are not final and are subject to change. This game supports an autosave feature. Alright. The corporate ladder. Congratulations. And welcome to your new position as the manager of your local supermarket branch. In this informational video, we'll be covering what things to expect and outline your new responsibilities. First things first, here are some basic instructions. Arrow keys to move, what the fuck? Why arrow keys to move? Why not WASD like normal? Spacebar to confirm. X to cancel this zero. What the fuck is these controls? Remember, your store's reputation and your employees' livelihoods are, your in, are in your hands. Before diving in, is this your first time as a manager? Yeah, it is. Customer service, day shift. To keep you grounded with your employees, you'll be expected to experience the day shift as they do. Except through a screen. The day shift will include tasks such as restocking inventory, regular cleaning, customer service, and the like. Know that every decision you make here will either affect your employees or, more importantly, your wallet. Not my wallet. Oh no. As the manager, you'll be expected to go above and beyond what is normally expected of a regular employee. Which is why your shift doesn't end when the sun goes down. In fact, it's just beginning. The other... But other than but other than that, the night shift is just like it is during the day, except for a few minor differences. Just make sure not to fall asleep. And finally, as the livelihoods of your store, so as your store, I I read that fa fast without even looking at it. But finally, as the lifeblood of your store, aside from your own. Your employees are your most valuable asset. Managing your employees or crew will determine how you, how far you will go in this industry. Note that every skill an employee uses will cost varying amounts of money. Alternatively, every employee can also goof off at your expense, getting the job done at no monetary cost. Or leave your service by quitting, inspiring and healing your crew at the cost of their termination.
Also note, each employee you interview may have unique liabilities. Liabilities range from having helpful qualities during encounters to completely detrimental flaws that may bring your crew down along with, that, along with them. Part of your job is to work with what you've got and to make the most of your current crew. But if someone new and better comes along... We trust that you... We trust you... Having a stroke. We trust you to have what it takes to fire and hire as you see fit. In the event of death. Upon employee inter termination, please note that lost employees will be automatically removed from the crew. Rest assured, you'll be able to fill that void in your crew, crew in no time. However, if you, the manager, were to succumb to your mortal tendencies... <coughs> <coughs> Your encounters will automatically end as well. Remember, despite all common morality, self-preservation is key in this industry. Once again, congratulations on making it this far. You are now armed with the knowledge you need to meet the responsibilities and expectations of your new managerial position. Work hard enough, and one day, you too can make it to the, to the corporate ladder. The interviewee before you sweats profusely as they stumble through with your questions. However, upon mentioning the final question, a sanguine trial begins to drip... Trail. <laughs> Fuck, I'm reading everything wrong, it seems. A sanguine trail begins to drip from their nose. Determined, they object to stopping the interview. New employee interview. Position, bagger. Liability, couch potato. Cannot dodge attacks. Recovery items moves more effective. Work hard, play hard, hit hard until the boss comes. Costs the manager 3 HP, can terminate the manager. Terminate the employee, but heals the crew. Neatly pack items to ensure... Optimal bags, real estate. Chance to stun. Is this a fucking RPG? Haphazardly bag customer items to get the move to get the line moving. Chance to cause nausea. Employee hired. You sneeze without covering your mouth. Nobody responds. It is now nine a.m. Take out the trash. We stock the so we stock the shelves. You see an empty shelf and need a restocking. Sit down and get to it. You find some product that fell behind the shelves some time ago. You got one expiry, expired energy bar. The staring contest with the wall continues. It is now 10 a.m. Take a quick break. There's a brief lull in work for a moment. Check employees. I've only got one employee. Continue shift. Crew gain 2 HP. Somewhere someone yawns way too loudly. It is now 11 a.m. Roam the floor. You see an unattended plastic bag. Look inside. Wild vermin jump out and nip at you before scurrying off. Minus 2 HP to the crew. The staring contest with the wall continues. It is now 2 p 12 p.m. Check store inventory. You see a stray box full of products scuttle away. Try to catch it. In the event of infestation. Is this... Is this, uh... Okay. Is is this like Earthbound? Is, is, this, is this supposed to be Earthbound? Stock product to keep things hidden. Target will evade until damage is taken. Yell at and pressure your staff to counter enemy attacks. Hmm. 
excuse me. Excuse me, I mean. Back to work. The hum of the lights becomes comforting for a moment. It is now 1 p.m. Excuse me. Turning around, you see a little kid looking up at you. They're holding a pen and paper. I'm doing a school report, so I want to ask. Do you like working here? Best job I ever had. No. No. <laughs> Do I like working here? No. A silent moment passes as you and the kid look on awkwardly. It seems like they were expecting a different, more optimistic answer. You may have ruined something for them. This deserves a smoke break. You get one cigarette. Don't look back. It'll just get weirder. Another fly joins its friends in the heat of the fluorescent bulb. It is now 2 p.m. Find missing carts. The ghost cart appears before you peer inside. You got... One expired entity bar, okay. Ghost card disappears without a, tra without a trace. It's now 3 p.m. New employee interview. Shipping associate. Liability hypochondriac. Max HP decreased 30%. Healing more effective. Yell at, yell at and frustrate your staff to counter enemy attacks. Time to avoid work-related injuries. Ally will block and counter enemy attacks. The other number fly joins its friends in the heat of the fluorescent bowl, but is now 4 p.m. Try to catch it. This is interesting as in terms of like an RPG, I guess. Terminate the manager. Improper packaging. Cost, chance to cause stun. Trash found. It's now 5 p.m. Time to clock up. You got $64. You got an industrial cleaner. Check in, please. Start shift. Uh, what's the difference? So, yeah, that's why I prefer pineapples on my pizza. You see a few customers and employees stop in their tracks. Uh, to look at the interview in progress. They look mildly upset, offended even. Custodian. I, I think I was supposed... I, I think I was supposed to pick Tuesday. I think... Loose cannon. Increased attack power. No control over employee. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I was supposed to, uh, take out the trash.
This is weird. <laughs> Hello, Raiders. Hello, Chili. Yeah. Sexy Raiders. At the moment, I'm, I'm in Duke mode. I'm in Duke mode for two more minutes. I don't know what the fuck this game is, but it's, uh, it's kind of weird. Yeah. Welcome, everyone. Thank you, Chili. Oh, here we go. Entertainment went down the toilet. Uh, it's the best thing. No, don't go, Daddy. Why? <laughs> Out of context, Daddy. Why? Why are you going, Daddy? No. Oh God. Anyway, so tell me why. <laughs> so. Yeah, this is the haunted PS1 demo disc, but this game is, uh, it's kind of like Earthbound, I, I think. It's like an RPG, I guess. It's really weird. You employee interview. Eh, uh, roam the floor, I guess. I've, I, I think I've got three employees now. You see an unintended plastic bag, look inside, you got three trash. Some scuttles behind the shelves. It's now 11 a.m. Uh, let's see. Try to catch it. Okay, here we go. This is this is the uh, the turn-based element. All right. You get a bunch of these like skills. Um. I quit. <laughs> and actually terminates the employee but heals the crew. And yeah, this just. Back to work. To battle the customers. <laughs> I haven't battled a customer yet, but I'm, I'm willing to bet we'll be battling a customer. Restock shelves. It, it, it seems to be a loop of, like, you, you, like, random things. Excuse me, turning around, you see a little ki Oh, this is the... We, we got this one. And back to normal. I'm doing the school report, so I want to ask... Do you like working here? <laughs> I'll answer. Because uh, last time I answered with no, this time I answered, best job I've ever had. Wow, that's the fifth one today. Looking at their paper, you see a few categories with some tote. With this one. Oh, I'm having strokes, as you can see. With some tally marks aside them. Thanks for your cooperation. They told me to give people things if they answer, so here. You got one sugar packet. Run along, kid, while you can. You sneeze without covering your mouth, nobody responds. <laughs> it's now 2pm. I got the trash. And thank you for the hydrate. Daddy went for sick. <laughs> never came back. <laughs> Sorry, I just read that. Is now 3 p. A light fart wafts through the store. Chat, do not fucking. Swear to God, if you do it, I'm going to be disappointed in you. I'm going to be fucking disappointed. All right, don't, don't. You want me? You want to? You want to disappoint? Your, your, you know, you want to disappoint Sean the Extra Guy, your your favorite streamer, right? I know, I know you. Dude. <laughs> well, that's a dude. <laughs> That didn't disappoint me, that just that just made me chuckle a little. Um anyway. Clean up wet mess. <laughs> There's a wet mess in your aisle. Yeah, wet mess. I'm willing to that is yellow. There's there's one one of two possibilities it could be. Alien blood. Or uh 
Or someone someone had a, had a bad accident with uh, with a Nyquil bottle. Um, the you have one mop. Clean up, clean up the mess. Sneeze without coming your under responds is now four p.m. Clean up dry mess. A broom, okay. Clean up the mess. Time to clock out. You got sixty-four dollars. Okay. So I was supposed to clock in Tuesday. Yeah. So I wasn't supposed to do Monday again because we already we already did Monday. Okay. The staring contest with the wall continues. It is now ten PM. Clean up wet mess. I have zero attempt to step over. I quit. Confirm and I are attracted to the mess. Interesting. You can definitely see the elements of, um, of Earthbound here. Okay. Money, money seems to be like a like a magic uh, meter, I guess. Goof off. Back to work. Trash found. You hear a ring in your ears. Now it's gone. A uh, new employee interview. Clean up at, at this aisle, at, at this fucking hour, really? Hello, Ninja. How you doing? How you doing, mate? Okay, clean up dry mess, I guess. I can't. I I need to. It requires one broom. I don't have any brooms. You tripped over. Minus three HP to the crew. Well, someone's gonna die. It's now twelve a.m. Restock the shelves. Stretching, stretching to reach the products, you feel something pop in your back. The crew becomes stunned. It's gone. It is now 1am. Take a quick break. As you let your guard down, you hear something approach from behind. In the event of intrusion. <laughs> Miss. Oh, okay. Well. I, uh... <laughs> I, I didn't think it would... I, look, I... Okay, I should... I guess I should have, um... I, I should have realized. It's you or them. This is your first strike. You got twenty-five dollars. But oh, pick that piece of trash. Probably best to throw it away properly. Okay, I guess this is someone's forgotten lunch. Can be eaten yourself or returned to the fridge. Okay, well this is the RP this is now starting to look more like an an RPG. This is what smoking does to your kids. Something is wedged among the boxes. You got an old warehouse key. Climb inside the box pile. Oh yes, it's a good idea. Break room. Liability, loose cannon, increase attack power, no controller, employee. 
Communal fridge for employee lunches. Zero lunches are returned to the fridge. Return missing pack lunch. Vending machine is full. Take a look. Cigarette. It's a mop in the fucking... I don't want 11, jeez. I guess I'll just get two of those. A tough mess. Mars the floor, what the fuck? Industrial cleaner, okay. I'm just gonna... how do I... Punch card customer service. Customer service usually used for announcement and returns, and customer service desk is a common vantage point for all the goings on of the store. I guess we're gonna do Tuesday again. Strangely, somebody responds, isn't it? Okay. Find missing parts. The ghost card appears before you peer inside. You got one expired energy bar. Uh, 11 p.m. Gather shopping carts. You see run okay, runaway carts barreling towards you. Attempt to dodge. Stock product to keep things hidden. Target will evade until damage is taken. Yell at and frustrate your staff to counter enemy attacks. Well, lost another employee. Well, I'm good at this game. <laughs> it's the second fucking, like, shift and I already fucking died again. It's you or them. This is your second strike. You got twenty-five dollars. I got twenty-five dollars. Twenty-five dollars. I do like my dollars. I guess that's the only place we can go. A bag full of money and trash. Well, I got zero employees. Manager's office, your office. For your safety, the door will remain locked. <laughs> it seems they cannot hear you. Okay, so the things I fought before were like a mannequin. What exactly do we sell here? It seems I am also a mannequin. As I do not have eyes. Bag full of money. Soap burns a little. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, oh, hmm? oh uh, it's occupied. Hey, you look fresh. Guess you don't know, huh? <clears throat> Guess you don't know, huh? People don't really use this toilet at this time. And people don't come in because I'm here. Kind of a mutual agreement we got going on. So, skedaddle. Thank you for your clean cleanliness. Your cleanliness. 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 Exit. Yes, I would very much like to exit this place. Security system will activate it if opened. Open the door. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> escape. Attempting to escape. Escape failed. Chew myself out. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. And somehow I survived that. I've got nothing else here now. Miss! Ha ha! I'm not, this is gonna like, it, uh, I'm not gonna be able to do this. No, I gotta, oh god. I, I don't know why I use that when I could have just used this. I'm gonna die. Why am I not dead yet? Why am I not dead yet? This is, uh... <laughs> this is kind of ridiculous. I should have died like long ago and I've, I, I, come on, come, I guess I'm just using trash, I'm using trash to damage my opponent. And somehow I defeated a fucking truck. I'm going back in now. <laughs> Did that seriously just happen? Oh, I don't trust that mannequin. I to use the correct department's punch card before clocking in. They, they, 
there have been many cases where workers assigned to customer service were actually working in produce or playing hooky in the warehouse. That's right, you know who you are. Also, keep track of whether you're working the day shift or night shift. Again, you will not get paid if you work one but are assigned to the other. Take it. You got missing pack lunch. Fifteen dollary dues. Okay. TV flickers a familiar flicker. Change filter. Leave alone. Okay. Check employees. I I, I need employees again. Fucking Monday. You see the table shake as the interviewee's restless leg continues to go off. You ask if they are okay. Sorry. Sorry, I've been holding it the entire time. Not sure what's going to happen if I get up from here. A mascot. Liability control freak. Max HP decreased 40%. Chance for an extra turn. Yeah, higher. He's a dog. He's a talking dog. He need to pee. Well, better, what better employee can, sh can we have than, than uh, an employee that will piss on everything? Just a market's territory. Uh, another customer walks in through the exit door. Th it is now 9 a.m. Well, I need I need to hire new employees. Cashier. A cashier? <laughs> Okay, um, control freak, max HP decrease 40%, chance it. To... Uh, okay, we'll just hire him. We, we need employees. A light fart wafts through the store, okay. A light fart, light fart wafts through the store. Again, chat, don't disappoint me. Don't you fucking dare. It is now 10 a.m. Roam the floor. In a plastic bag, you got one expired energy bar. Yet another fly joins its friends. 11 a.m. <laughs> Shopping carts. Yes, well, you disappoint me. Your it, yours was the fart that walked through the store. We all know that now. Thank you for telling everyone. I mean, thank you. You know, clearly you need to tell everyone that your fart wafted wafted through the store. Um, that is it, obvious, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, you see some runaway cards barreling towards you. Attempt to dodge. Oh, God. Okay, it's only one. It's only one card. Nature calls. Lay a fresh one and assault targets with smell. Electric mode. Switch your cart to electric mode, making it silent. <laughs> Makes the user hidden. Fast hands, fast as can. Scan items quicker than the customer notices. Trash! It's now 12 p.m. shift. Crew gain 2 HP. Somewhere someone yawns way too loudly. It's now 1 p.m. Excuse me. Oh, another kid. I guess just always answer. It's the best job I've had. Light fart. Another one. 
another another fart. But at this point, we all know it was we all know it was Blubetel. So we all know it was him. Since he farted, he told everyone by you know simply redeeming the uh, fart. So he's proud of himself. Just remember that, everyone. Uh, restock the shelves. Finds a program behind the shelves. Inspired energy bar. And he farted again. And he did not bat an eyelid. Another fucking product. 4 p.m. Pops a man. Thank you. You got sixty four dollars. Let's try night shift again. Restock shelves. Your eyes close for a moment. You're disappointingly still here. Find missing carts, roam the floor. See, unintended plastic bag, look inside. You got one expired energy bar. Twelve AM. Clean up wet mess. As you let your guard down, you hear something approach from behind. Turn around. Mannequin again. Its limbs grasp towards you. Okay. Hang on. Skill. Item. Sugar rush, sugar rush. S U G A R. Da 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 da. They they got two extra turns, that realizing. Get back to work. I said get back to work. I guess I guess I'm Mr. Krabs. I, I guess that makes sense that I am Mr. Krabs. I am the manager of this store. I don't own the store, so I'm not quite like Mr. Krabs because Mr. Krabs owns the Krusty Krab. Uh, someone somewhere lets out a small fart. Again. I mean, are you miserable and, uh, play a clarinet and you don't want this job anymore? No, you're, you're the, um, you're the fish that keeps on coming in and farts, it farts on the fucking tables. And, ca and causes other fish to leave. No, that is what you are. Gather shopping carts, restock the shelves. Attempt to dodge. This shit again.
There we go. Bag with some money found. Well, this 2am shift went a lot better than the last few. Returning to the customer service counter, you see that somehow a bunch of shopping carts and mannequins from the store were placed behind the counter. It's a pretty fragile mess, so removing just one thing will clear it out. Remove the mannequins first. Remove the carts first. Remove the mannequins first. Ah, this mannequin has armor. Or clothes, but you know. Counter attack. Haha. -ha. Okay. I got the call of nature. Modern trash. Bag with some money found. Co-workers start passing by. You see them side-eye as you catch your breath. Nothing to see here. 3 a.m. Take a quick break. You let your gut... <sighs> Fuck's sake. trash. Shit. I've got no money now. Trash. I guess you can't, you can't take a break during the night. Someone that I fart again. We suck the shelves. <sighs> it's now five p.m. New employee interview. Physician, custodian. Liability, control freak. Max HP, okay. I, I got another person that has a chance for an extra turn. It's now 6am, time to clock out. You got $64. Wednesday now. A day shift and a night shift. Oh dear. Okay, I guess this is the last one. Of the demo, at least. The air vibrates with tension as the prospective employee comes up to you. You reach, the, you reach to shake their hand, but feel nothing but pain and joints popping out of place. The Herculean, Herculean grip, uh, solid and unyielding, they speak. Hello! Nice! It's so nice to meet you! I'm just going to assume that they're Arnold Schwarzenegger. A young Arnold Schwarzenegger, more, to be more specific. New employee interview. Bagger. Unskilled. No pros, no cons.
Okay. Sharp pricks you. If something sharp pricks you. Well, good. You sneeze without covering your mouth. Nobody responds. It's now 10 a.m. I got $10. Wait, how many employees do I have now? I have... Uh, a light fart. Again with these light farts. Take a quick break. Check employees. Okay. Continue shift. Gain two HP. You got five dollars. I think I think I got more than five dollars there. Uh, customer is groovingly is grooving. I don't know why I went groovingly. A customer is grooving pretty hard to the Muzak on the speakers. The Muzak. Okay. You notice that the large balls from the display cage have gotten loose and are now bouncing all across the store. Following the trail, you see a group of teens looking... Fucking hell, can I read anything today? It seems I'm just like... It, it seems I've gained dyslexia as a skill. As a curse. <laughs> just for today. Uh, following the trail, you see a group of teens taking turns shooting them back into the cage. Join them. Join them. The teens cheer as you proceed to make shot after shot, slowly filling up the display cage. <coughs> they also make themselves useful fetching the ball scattered across the store. Once you are done, each of them high fives you and leaves their own leaves of their own volition. Uh, the crew blew off some steam. HP regen. Another customer walks in through the exit door. Attempt to dodge, I guess. Skill. Cleans up, cleans things up in more ways than one. Leaves a horrible mess, though. You just mop there. Marks a target. Noxious trash. The noxious ass. Take a quick break. Got five dollars. Take out the trash! The crew becomes nauseated. You got two trash.
time for the night shift. It's now 10 p.m. Try to catch it. Oh no. Uh, he he's do it, he could do it again. All right. Wow, he he got three turns. That is that is uh, amazing. Okay, surely. Back to work. It's now 11 p.m. Twelve a.m. Oh, yeah, you, you can't you can't take a break during the night. Well, I'm just gonna go hidden again. Inspired energy bar, skill. Hang on, wait. Item, trash. Item, trash, I guess. <laughs> uh. Kind of thinking about having this one quit. That way it heals me. Trash! 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 Lucky trash. Two dollars. There we go. See, I, okay, I, I kind of... I, I, I kind of like the gameplay loop, but... In no way would I play through this game. Like, the full version. Because it's just not... Not really my style. Uh, I definitely prefer the tradi um, traditional, like, Earthbound, um, you know, walking around a town and encountering shit, rather than this. Gather shopping carts. Get the dodge. Oh, no! Not these ones. Spider energy bar. Yeah, 
A lot of trash. Lucky trash. Two dollars. Great. Heal! Noxious trash. I can only open trash. Trash! Trash! I hate garbage! Ah! Oh, God damn it, I lost my dog. In one hit, lost my dog. Yep, no employee interview. Clerk, liability, unskilled. Got no money to fight. Sorry, I'm busy. I mean, what else can I do? Noxious trash. There we go. Got five dollars. It's the only thing I can fucking do. Unravel trash to find. <laughs> Fucking hell, I, I, this needs to be over soon, come on. 4 a.m. Roam the floor. Um. Roam the floor. Pack of cigarettes. Someone lets out a small fart. Because of course they do. You hear a metallic clatter coming from out back. On investigating you see that some employee lockers were left open, swinging on their hinges. Following the trail of open lockers you stumble upon a strange sight. A strange sight of worship. Approach with caution. Fuck's sake, I can't... I don't have any... I don't have anything. I don't have anything. Well, I was nearly finished with that. I was nearly finished. Okay, that, that, that's gonna be it. This game. Two title. It, it was okay. But, um... Yeah, kind of weird. It was definitely like, you know, RPG, um, turn-based uh, combat thing, but yeah, it was really weird. Anyway, I guess uh, the next game, um, Miracle Bug.
Electric Limbo. Miracle Bug in the Electric Limbo. Bug has found himself in a mysterious limbo realm. Take a look around and try to make sense of this place. Encounter a passage to the next layer. Existentialism. Mild. I, well, now I've got to fucking do this. <laughs> There's mild existentialism in it. Okay. Well, apparently I can use a controller for this. Bug. Bagu. Controls are kind of weird. Oh, why, hello there, Pilgrim. I was just uh, stargazing. I wasn't expecting someone to just walk up to me and no less communicate with me. Hello. This realm is fine for gazing every so often. You see a shooting star in the eternal darkness. Why, there is not a thing quite as lovely. This music is like kind of, kind of loudish. Shadows. Yes or no? The sh what shadows are we talking here? The shadows. Hello, bug. You need not fear me. Here, the swamp is dark and deep. Stay close to me, for uh, for I will guide you. And you will not sink. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't even know if what I'm doing is uh, is progressing the mission, the, the story. I mean. So far, like there hasn't been like there hasn't been too many like jump scary type stuff. A lot of it's just been really weird. Oh, there we goes. An overpowering smell of sweetness and citrus. It makes your brain tickle. <laughs> it tickles. Bug. Oh, bug. Are you lost, bug? Yeah, I kind of am. What is this music? Begin ascension. Ready. Set. 
begin. Huh? What? Balance the scales. Is, is this some warrior wear shit? What the fuck? Use your knowledge. Select the gibbous moon. I don't know what the gibbous moon is. What? Okay, that's the gibbous moon. Learn and teach in return. What? What? Oh, it's a... Oh, I know what it is. It's a... Um... This is really weird, okay. It's kind of weird the way it's controlled. There we go. This is really like... Collect. this one. You have no power here. Climb. Focus on spirit. That spirit? <laughs> Focus heal. Thing. So there's a bit, a bit of warrior wear elements there. Kind of cool. You are free to go now. Why, thank you. <laughs> that was odd. Really odd. Uh, okay, Gob. Uh, Gob by Gamma Girl. After a deep slumber, a trip to the vending machine spirals into an unintentional journey underground. Play as Gob to solve the puzzles of your messy home and trudge through the unseen corners of a cavernous tunnel network. Mash things together, break them apart, and observe the environment to get yourself back home. Okay. Gob. Gob, what are you doing? Goddamn shit, radio. Come on, work. What the fuck? Why is it... Why is it trying to start in VR? Uh... 
okay, it, it wanted to start in, in VR. And now my main screen is, is black. My, my main screen is black. Uh, everything is black at the moment. What the fuck is going on? I, th this game, it, it seems to not, uh, not play well. <sighs> really? Like, what is, what is going on? Uh, I, okay, so I can see it, like, from this view. I can't hear it. I need to, like, edit the options. That's what I need. I need to go into, like, the options menu. Please. So I can... <sighs> Alright, come on, wake up. And then I can... Come on. Okay. I assume that's options. Oh yeah, great, great options menu. Good options menu. Wow. Uh, <laughs> okay, not a good first impression with the game. Well, I guess we're playing it in a window. Hang on. I'll actually try and capture it. That's what I'll do. Gob. And it's not capturing it. It doesn't know what to do. God's sake. Okay, hang on. Wow, it, it can't even capture the window. It, it, it can't even capture it in windowed mode. This game, uh... You know what? Immediately, upon first impression, it's not a good first impression. So, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, but that's, uh, very bad. Optimize your game. Because, for some reason, it wanted to start VR. And, uh,. Yeah, I, the, the, the game options were non-existent, basically. Fear the spotlight. Cozy game pals. Your friend Amy has mysteriously vanished at Sunnyside High. Search for her in an abandoned area, but beware, something seems to be lurking there with you. Implied obsessive relationship. So yeah, the horror so far hasn't been jump scares and, you know, oh, disturbing psychological themes. It's more been like weird shit. And just other kinds of horror. There were some decent games out of it. You know, there was the that, um, uh, what was it? Cat Bomber? Bomber Cat? Uh, I forget what it was. Okay. Option. Okay, no options. But we have to fear the spotlight. Technical difficulties are the true horror. You know what? The true horror of that game was the technical difficulties. I can agree with that. My friend Amy was supposed to meet me in the library after school, but she never showed up. 
I searched and found her wandering into a section of the school that was burned down, that was burned down years ago. I know I'm not supposed to go in here, but something is up with Amy and I have to find her. Something is up with Amy and I have to find her. That's the way I should have read it. Why is Spacebar Crouch? I am hiding. I know you are here somewhere. Where are you? I'm going to find you, my little starlet. Okay, yeah, this is this is horror themes. Mrs. Bella's journalism class. Well, at least the torch is acting like a real torch. It's a clipboard that reads, Please provide your birthday so we can include you on the monthly birthday celebrations. Kate, uh, sorry, I have to... <laughs> August 23rd, March 10th, uh, September 15th, May 17th, October 11th. For Kate, Bobby, Raul, Melissa and Chrissy. Cake will be provided at each celebration. It's a tube with a poster in it. The poster is for a school play. It has a picture of two people holding hands on it. Escaped over the inventory. Lungs. I got a lung meter. There's definitely a bit of Silent Hill vibes going on here. This is the first like traditional horror game, I'd, I'd say. It's an old projector. Looks like the power switch still works, but the light bulb inside isn't turning on. I bet I could fix this projector with the right materials. Flashlight. No. It's a handwritten note. It reads, Did you hear? Amber got sick. Did you hear? Amber got so sick now, Chrissy is getting the lead in the play. Of course, we get skipped over for the part. Ugh. I convinced Bobby to steal the drama room key so we can ruin her costume. He's such a sucker for me. Mel. I guess bullies exist on every. I guess bullies exist in every generation. It's an inhaler. This will be helpful if my health is ever low and my lungs need some relief. It's a school newspaper. It reads, Sunnyside News, the premiere of the Phantom of the Opera will be coming this fall. <laughs> ow. Oh, I just bit my tongue. Ah. Uh, ow, ow, ow. Oh, uh, that... Ah. Uh. Oh, that was bad. We interviewed the teacher in charge of the production, Miss Crane, Mr. Crane, about the show. I can't believe the school had a newspaper and drama club. They didn't bring these. They didn't bring these back after the fire. The locker is locked. Looks like I can open it with the right combination. Yeah, I assume there's probably a combination somewhere. Wait a minute. Eight, three, nine, five, one, maybe? No. No. Yeah. 
Yeah, there's definitely some um, Silent Hill vibes here. The door is locked. Examine. I really poured my heart out in this letter. I hope I can give this to her. Sunnyside Theatre. There's a handwritten note. Hey, Melissa. I stole the drama room key like you asked. I have it stashed in my locker in the journalism class. The combo is in your is the combo is your birthday. Ah, oh, okay. Will you go with me to the movies now, like you promised? Hmm, this kid really liked Melissa. That's a bulletin board. It's mostly filled with school uh, flyers with some boring announcements. There is a single photo of a group of students with their teacher. Below the photo, it reads "Drama Club, Mr. Crane." Looks like a poster used to be up here. There's a placard underneath that reads, A fate split between death and love. It's probably not that one. Uh, spied lovers meeting. Yes, it fits. I didn't know if you. I, I, I could have went to the um, this classroom, but you know. Okay, Melissa. Zero five one seven. Zero five one seven. Oops. Shit. I'm in. It's a key with an engraving that says drama class. script for a school rendition of The Phantom of the Opera. On the cover it reads, starring Amber, the name Amber is crossed out and written above is Chrissy. <laughs> There's a bunch of old scripts and stuff for the theatre class. Uh, there's a bunch of pictures of the students, too. They look, they look like they're having fun. Wait, is this my friend Amy in here? There's so many pictures of her. Wait a second. No, this can't be her. These pictures, these pictures are dated for 25 years ago. Wow, it sure looks like her, though. Weird.
Our friend is a ghost. It's a photo of the school. But there's something odd about it. It looks like there is something behind it. What the? There's a panel back here. It's shut tight. I'll need some way to remove these screws if I want to search behind the panel. Screwdriver. Need a screwdriver. Looks like a bunch of awards for the drama teacher. Must be old since we don't even have a drama class anymore. This one says Teacher of the Year. There's a yearbook snippet for the dreamiest teacher. And it goes on. It's a tube with a poster in it. Poster is for a school play. It has a picture of a girl on a stage on it. Okay. just an inhaler let's see how close it used to be up here a dazzling performance a screwdriver somewhere. Maybe I have to open up a locker? Oh god, I'm fucked.
What the fuck? No, come on! How? I'm under this desk. There's gotta be something I'm I'm missing. I might be blinding something. I don't know. No. Daniel, keep using explosives. It's a uh, it's opposite day. Okay, I. I don't know what else. Uh... this, didn't I? This looks like something, but it's not. It's just like a random texture. So, yeah, there's... Drama club, flashlight, that's all, that's all I have. I'm trying to find a screwdriver, but I can't find a screwdriver. A hanged man. Tragic beginning. Wait, what's that? Skull in a boy's face. A 
fight split between death and love. Oh. Okay, well that's what I was supposed to do. This must be where Amy has gone. I hope she's okay. End of demo. Okay. Well, that was our first horror one. <laughs> like, proper horror. Fear the spotlight is being made by just two people. That's us. Hello. It means the world that you played our demo. We hope you enjoyed it. The full version of Fear of the Spotlight will be available in 2022. Please wish this us on Steam for updates along, with, along the way. Okay. You know what? I'll give him a chance. Sorry to skip the credits. Because this is what I'm going to do. Fear the spotlight. This looks like it's like a very, um, very Silent Hill inspired uh, gameplay. A little bit of Resident Evil, maybe. In terms of like puzzle solving, but I, the thing is, I've never played, um, I've never played, uh, Silent Hill. But, you know. House of Necrosis. Blood, gore, animal cruelty, substance abuse. A special forces team went missing in an old mansion. You were sent to discover why. Yeah, sorry. You were, just, you were sent to discover why. There's no comma there. I don't know why I decided to pause. But anyway. House of Necrosis. This looks like a zombie survival, I guess. Could be wrong. Just a black screen at the moment. Why does... Seriously. Why do some of these games just not want to fucking work? Like, I'm interested in what this is. But if your game don't work... How the fuck am I meant to play it? Okay, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Let me do this, hang on. Hang on. What's it called again? Uh... House of Necrosis. Okay. Properties. Run as administrator. And also run this in compatibility mode for Windows 7. Because sometimes it's as simple as that. No. Disable full screen optimizations, maybe?
Yeah, no, no, even starting... This is the second game that just doesn't want to work. And again, Be Knighted looks like it could be a good game, and so is this, I guess. But it doesn't want to work. Question mark, okay. Dead letter department. Working at an attempt data entry job, you type and transcribe the lost mail and letters that have nowhere else to go. But as days carry on, the oddities in the mail begin to emerge. At this point, we may as well, like, like I think we played, like, what, four games? Three? Four? I, yeah, yeah, four. Four. We've played four games so far. Dear mum, dear dad, dear love. Hey, asshole. Hey, asshole. Nothing compared to the hell that was living with you. My time here has been brutal. This new city is confusing and harsh. What is with the crustiness of this music? I think that's supposed to be how it is. It's really disconcerting. Um... Someone I met here booked me up with this computer job while I get myself back together. I've got a data entry job typing up the junk that computers can't auto-read. I miss you. <laughs> just, <laughs> just someone I know really well that I call asshole to fuck with them. Oh, okay, first person then. This is definitely not in a PS1 style. This is in a uh, green filter. Um. Re really uh, good looking game style. Q ready for processing. Downloading from server. Please type in the highlighted text. Nine seven seven six Lafe Yep Shoal Rockfield Wisconsin five three 
Zero two two. Insert zoom. Oh, right, okay. Just makes me curious as to what the last one was. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm going to restart that. Just in case there was something on the other side. I'm going to restart. And then we'll have to. I'll have to do the thing again. This time I'll go, like, opposite of what I did. Dear love. But nothing compared to the hell that I was living with you. This new city is weird and cool. I'm getting used to it. I fucked everything up. <laughs> Get fucked. <laughs> I fucked everything up. Get fucked. Get fucked. I think I think uh, if I was sending this to uh, to Arthur, she'd she'd be she'd be concerned. Like, what the hell's going on with you? Love, John. I fucked everything up. Get fucked. This is the type of game that you'd use the uh, PlayStation mouse and keyboard for. Oh wait, hang on. That highlighted text. Auto suggest. Field Mackie Hmm. 
Wow, it's getting them completely wrong. I, could, I guess ID is Idaho. 83611 Harvard University Insert Zoom. Northeast Mar Marysville. Western Australia. No, I'm kidding. Denia Cooper. Second drive. There's a, there's those uh, creative um, Creative uh, American streets. Is that Marysville? <coughs> Marysville, Western Australia. I'm kidding. Again, it's not Western Australia. It's, uh, what is it? Washington. Turn for postage. Wow, great handwriting. Start with it then. Um, three, four, two, seven. What was that? He, he, no, him, Mima, Nina. What letter is that? Me, uh, what is this handwriting reading simulator? What the. Uh, Dina? Mima? I'm just gonna go Nina. Uh, IP? Point eight nine seven. Apartment. Oh, apartment. Apartment. Oh, it's apartment. It says apartment. Apartment eight nine seven. Morganville, New Jersey. New Jersey. Mima. That was Mima. It was Mima. Okay. Burnett Bear.
McKee, oh, uh, Mickey, McKee City. F2. Sally Sue's Diner. What? Huey from Yermo. What? What is this handwriting? Hello from Yermo. What the fuck was that? This is... Uh. That was weird. Kissing me. West Middleton, Indiana. Hmm. There's probably going to be a disturbing one. I mean, we had a disturbing one last, uh, the last time, but I skipped over it thinking, what the fuck? Kendra Ellsworth. Strangely enough, this is kind of, uh, Like, I, I'd, I'd do this for a job if you paid me enough. Klein's Cause, New Mexico. Kendra Ellsworth. Uh, two seven one. Bremerton.
no Quincy. Uh, Marina Dang. I'm sorry, Marina Dang. Seven nine seven four. I wonder if these like a real, a real like streets and shit. Nashua, New Hampshire. What the fuck is this? Infection with Angostrongulus can candidesis rat lung worm can occur after voluntarily or inadvertently consuming raw great grey slugs. And even unwashed fruits and vegetables, severe infection will lead to ascending weakness, respiratory failure, and muscle atrophy, and will lead to the death and lead to death if not treated. It wants me to okay. Occasionally, larvae will enter ocular structures, even with treatment. Depending, I'm, I'm doing this while not looking at my keyboard on the uh, location of infection. The hell was that? Infection. The patient may suffer. Chronic pain as a result. Okay. There's some there's some weird stuff going on. I wonder if this is the entire game. Like, I think this is site uh, 942. Vista. I'm going to guess it's going to be KA, isn't it? Because, sorry, CA, because California. Uh, Vista, California. 92083. Tip a canoe. Uh, 
Okay. What the hell is that on the back? Yo, MonsterCon is going alright, I'm bored. Here's a postcard, Max. I'm, I'm bored. Here's, and thank you for the hy uh, hydrate. Here's a postcard. Max. Something fucked up is going on and I, I I'm waiting for something to happen. Idaho Falls. Little five points. Join the Kudan Card family. <coughs> Our valued customer at uh six seven six three two. Illinois. Poplar Grove, I'm guessing that's the one. Jolene Severson. Sev Severson. Seven eight three four Henryville Inside. CT. What's CT? Connecticut, right? Am I right? Connecticut? Downloading from server. Pineapple. Walnuts, peanuts, pineapple smells. Go home.
Fred. Fred, Virginia. There's a there's a place called Fred, Virginia. Ah, oh, someone sent a dick in this one. Look at it. There's a dick. Someone sent their dick. Eight seven one two eight seven one two Red Vale Wayland Ken Wayland, Kentucky Oops it's, This is weirdly fascinating and I don't know why. Cindy Morley. Two seven five two. What does I say? Byfield. I feel I feel like I should be paid doing this. Hobart. <laughs> that was weird. Just a little power out. Washing machine. No, I'm kidding. Clean the testicles by gently removing the membrane. Cut the testicles into long, thin pieces and wash them thoroughly. <coughs> I, I never thought I'd be seeing that t t t during this stream. Something about washing testicles. Bring a liter of what? Anyone notice the, uh, the 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 figure that's like uh, it's to the right of us? Because I do. I do now. And I am scared. He's not leaving. He he is staying there. He is uh, he's visiting us. Bring a liter of water to a boil. Then place. Then place. The testicle strips. <laughs> and he's gone. He left. Testicle strips. Inside. One. By. One. Let them boil. <laughs> for <laughs> about five to eight minutes. In the meantime, boil another liter of water in a different pan. When the testicle fuck was that? When the testicles are ready, 
wash, wash them again with the boiled water. Why? The question is, why is this on a fucking postcard? This is this is a postcard, right? Yeah. Why? Why is this on a postcard? Put olive oil in a pan and let it warm for two minutes. Add testicles, salt, pepper, onion, and any other spices you like. Allow them to fry until the color becomes brownish golden. Serve with fresh lemon garnish. And that is how you cook a man's testicles. <laughs> now it turns out it's just talking about, um, what are they called? Rocky Mountain Oysters? <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is what the, what it's talking about. Rocky Mountain Oysters, which is what... I, I, I don't know where it is, but, yeah, they, they, um... You know, eating cow testicles, or bull testicles, whatever. And they're called Rocky Mountain Oysters. So, there you go. Apparently there's bomb blasts going up above. Oh, we've already done this one. What the hell? Hello from one of the most southern cities in the world. Tomorrow I get on a boat. Antarctica. I will see uh, whales and chase penguins Oops. and and probably I hope the deal the deal is going well well uh, the copy. And men are quite, are quite good in Argentina. Next stop. Next stop, comma. I'm doing this. I'm doing the speed. Okay, I'm, I'm now trying to entertain myself. I don't. I should just stop playing this game. But like, I'm fascinated like, as to what's going to happen next. Like, or is nothing going to happen? I maybe nothing will happen. the last game all over again. The weird one. Whatever it was. Dang, dang, go, sang, yar.
Mini Aqua. Are we gonna have a friend again? That black hole, that eye wasn't there before. That 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 eye definitely was not there. It that that just appeared there. And my computer's slowly going, starting to fuck up. There's 65 stuff left, apparently. And, and welcome, raiders, to this really weird game. Welcome, Ninja. Thank you for the raid. Thank you, sexy raiders. How's it going? The sexy ninja of comedy is well, the stream with five things are getting minutes. fucked up. You, you arrived at the good time. Apparently the queue remains 65. What is going on? See, now... This is why it's worth, um... Continuing. No sound has been played from the... Looks like you, you were muted or something. Or maybe it's just not playing? I don't yeah, know what's going on. Was during 2022. Oh, there you go. There we go. There we go. Another quote added. To open your stream uh, in another tab, and it looks like clips was possible now. Even you Another random clip that... <laughs> out, of con out of context or just like... Why did someone clip that, you know? <clears throat> I gotta go through my clips and get rid of some of the clips that just don't make sense. Anyway. Uh, I, I guess I'm gonna have to work with whatever the hell this is. Brandy's continued to drift in and out of consciousness. I guess I would just go on with my work, you know. It, but I can still work with this. Again. Like, for finally collapsing again. May we's killed. Brandes by stabbing him in the throat after which he hung the bo is this I think the screen's getting even more fucked up now on a meat hook dismembered and ate the corpse Over the next... Okay, that eye just blinked. I think that eye just blinked. I, I swear to god I saw the eye blink. Am I seeing things? Did the eye just fucking blink? The next ten months. Oh, another eye. Okay. It's fine. It's just a normal Friday, really. Body parts. Storing body parts in his freezer. Under pizza boxes. Oh, like you do, you know. And consuming up to 20 kilograms. We'll stop. Oh, how beautiful. I'm cold. I love it here, but I'm cold. And they're, and they're bad Wi-Fi. So I'm behind on my drama. My K-drama. And it's fucking gorgeous. It's not a pun. I, I'm, I'm cold. I love it, here, but I'm cold. 
What is this game anyway? Uh, it's fuck now. I've forgotten what it was, but um, it's uh, part of the PS One uh, demo disc. I'll, I'll know. I'll know after it's ended. After I possibly die. So I'm behind on my K-drama. And it's fucking gorgeous. Pun intended. Deal. 62, apparently. Another, okay. Uh, 654. So, six, sorry. 6554. Hensel. Des Mo Desmoines. Desmoines. IA. I'll just correct that. Five zero two three nine. It's getting progressively more fucked up. Uh, there's a fucking shoe on it. Uh, nine three oh four. Sunnyvale. You know, I, 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 I get what this is supposed to do. It's meant to teach you, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, you're right, they're just eating chips behind me. You, like, at least be quiet with it. I, um, what's it called? Uh, ah, oh, fuck, it's where you, like, you don't look at the keyboard. It's meant to teach you that. But, you know, in an interesting way. In a horror way. Downloading from server. Timothea. Christopherson. Eight, fuck, seven, eight. I'm gonna, I'm trying it without looking. Crunch, crunch. Should I tell them the Roshi story? What is it? Uh, 29653. That's F1, yeah. Joey! Jo- Oh, red light. Okay. G O Fuck. Um, uh, thank you for the hydrate. Not that kind of Roshi. The Sean play Smash Brothers. Cool. I, I haven't played That's in a while. Cool. And into the mouth. And thank you for the follow. Eat that gamer. I that gamer. <laughs> Welcome to the King of Antique Memes, where we played weird fucking game like this. Brothers of Saint Francis. Seven seven. C 
773 port uh, I am trying to do it without looking at the keyboard uh Does that say Porter or Parker? I'm gonna go Parker Avenue and then I'll I'll try Porter Avenue. That rocks Roxbury. Porter Avenue. Okay, it was Porter. It was right. I didn't see that eye blink again, did I? I now, I'm, now I think I'm going crazy. Gwyneth Massey. Uh, 16... 43... What does that say? Needs more. N need more. Laurel... Laurel... Am I, am I, is my face zooming out? I feel like I'm, I'm slowly zooming out. Yeah, it is. Ori Dupuis. Uh, 9 6. Not. Fuck. 9 2. Casnovia. Fuck. This is. This is me trying. Uh, Casnovia P dot uh, O Vox Number What was number? I, I need to Yeah, number three Number seven Seven, four, nine, seven I guess <laughs> Another Another raid Hello, ready Three, four, five Thank you for the raid. That's three raids today. Thank you. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, everyone. Ready, oh, my is back. Stream with one cute butt ah, my back. Baby. Okay. I, uh, is, is it going to tell me pen, pendroy, pendroy? It doesn't matter. I forgot. It doesn't matter. It's fine. I can just do this. F1. Or redo free. Okay. I did not give Karma a shout out. No, of course not. Uh, don't, don't be giving me a shout out. I uh, I oh, I'll just stretch again. Don't worry. I didn't give you a lick either. Nope. What? Don't lick me, bitch. You know what? Just because you said that. The and we will never hear anything about it. <laughs> I fucked everything up. I fucked everything up. The future is burning. See, now we're getting to the fucked up stuff. Okay, now we're back to, um... Now we're back to the first person mode. Again, this is supposed to be PS1. But I don't see the PS1 stuff. I just want to return to my computer! Please! Ah. Oh.
And this was just a demo. Dead letter department. That's what that's what it's called. Coming to Steam. That's right. I remember there was the, yeah. Full job includes expanded storyline, more surreal, rich work atmosphere, and lost letters to encounter. Multiple advancement paths, multiple endings, performance recognition. Interesting. Exit demo. So yeah, dead letter department. You can check it out on Steam, apparently, which I'm... I'll check it out. I think that's the last one I'll do, and then I'll... Uh, 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 yeah. I think I'm gonna switch to, um, Duke Nukem 64. Oh, there it is. Dead letter department. That was actually okay. It was really weird. Really weird, though. But I don't see the PS1 aesthetics. I don't know why this was included in the PS1 uh, demo disc. Because this is definitely not uh, PS1 inspired, I should say. Okay. So how many more are there? Oh no, shit, we've actually done them all. Shit. We actually did all of them. It was just benighted and, um... That didn't quite work, either. So, three of them didn't work. And then there's two mystery games. I don't know what these are supposed to be. Okay. That's actually all of them. That's actually all the, uh... The PlayStation 1 demo, uh, disc games. Trouble is, yeah, three of them... Technically, two of them didn't just didn't work at all. One of them did work, but it was it. We we couldn't get it to for some reason. It was blacking out on my like it was blacking out my screen on full screen, and it wanted to start fucking Steam VR for some reason. Um, but yeah, no, that was actually those were good. Um, yeah, yeah, no, um. There was a couple of them that were that were very fascinating, and there was a f there was a few of them that were scary. That last one was uh, kind of disturbing as to what was happening. <laughs> I just I kept going because I wanted to see how fucked up it could get. Um, 